Hey, what's going on, guys? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today I'm with Kano OS or Kano OS, whatever you want to call it. It's running on my Raspberry Pi 3. Now they sell kits, these awesome kits for kids. Hey, this is a great operating system to start with if you were just starting out with Linux. This is one of the best things that I've ever seen. Let's get into it. This is from the start. Um, I'm actually going to set this up for my daughter later on, but I wanted to show you guys because I went into it and I was blown away by how awesome this operating system is. Switches speak in code. Ones and zeros. One means yes, zero means no. This is binary. Press enter to go deeper. Words, sounds, and pictures all get stored in the binary code. So does your computer's secret password. Type the password in human letters. ETA Prime, follow the white rabbit. Type CD rabbit hole, then press enter. So this is how the operating system starts out. We're at the binary border right now. I'm using my arrow keys to move around. This is a great learning tool for children and adults. So they do market it to kids, but I got to say, this is really cool if you're just starting out. So I'm running this off of a 16 gigabyte SanDisk Class 10 SD card and I have a wireless mouse and keyboard combination hooked up. I did not hear a sound because I'm through my HDMI right now. I do not have the Kano kit, so I'm going to use my TV speakers. So you can customize your character and everything. And I'll just connect to an open network here. Pi 3 has built in Wi Fi and Bluetooth, so I didn't need any adapters with this. The OS is free to download. You do not need to buy any of their kits or anything. You can download the operating system and put it on your own Pi. Use your own keyboard and mouse. And I definitely suggest if you have children and you want them to get into Linux, download this and let them use it. So I'm not above playing games. As all of you may know, I do a lot of old school retro emulation and this is marketed towards children, but the UI is beautiful here. Um, so I haven't messed with it much at all. We got a Kano code, make art, make Minecraft, make light, YouTube, internet, terminal, profile, and the Kano apps. I haven't even opened this up. We're going to see what's in here. Really cool little intro music too. And we have a apps list here. We got code, games, media, tools, other. So we got Chromium web browser under code. Kano code, make art, make Minecraft, make Pong. So it's very, very simple to use. We even have Scratch down here. But one of the coolest features that I found within this operating system was if I go back to dashboard and we go to story mode, this operating system has a story mode built in. We're going to launch story mode here. We're entering the computer now. So this is the binary border that we're in right now. We're not in the computer. If we go up here, we can go back into the computer, but we're gonna go down the hole. SD Beach. This is so cool. So we can go up to people and talk to them. You can make your own pawn game, you know. 
And we'll have to go talk to somebody about doing that. But for right now, we're just going to wander around and see what's over here. Go follow that rabbit. The power port tool. Do you know that the whole computer is powered by energy brought in through the red cable? I don't have a red cable, though. This is awesome. Really awesome learning tool for adults, even. So we'll go up here. To quests, press Q. Explore the world. Intro to making Pong. Power port. Completed quest. Nothing yet. And we have a codex. Voltage. So I am very impressed with this operating system here. One of the best learning tools that I have ever seen for children. Be it on Windows, Mac, Linux, any operating system at all. This can get them very used to using the computer. So obviously a Flappy Bird copy. That is pretty awesome. Either Ethernet cables or HDMI cables here. Press escape. So we're now at Logic Lake here. So here's the deal, guys. I really just wanted to show you this. I don't want to spoil all of it for you, but if you have children or you just want to mess around with this, go ahead and download it, install it on your Raspberry Pi. It'll work on the Raspberry Pi 1, 2, 3, and it'll possibly work on the Raspberry Pi 0. This is on the Raspberry Pi 3, though. And I'm loving it. I got a 5-year-old daughter, and I have a 2-year-old son. So I want to set up a Raspberry Pi 2 for them so they can mess with this. They're already very familiar with Android, obviously. I mean, a lot of kids have their little Android phones. Mostly, they play games and go on YouTube and stuff like that. But I'd like to get them introduced to Linux just like this. This is really, really awesome. Go back to the dashboard. So we got internet, YouTube. Let's make Minecraft. So create a diamond floor. Getters block type. No, I want diamond. Setters, set floor. And I guess we link them up. Numbers. We'll change this to Hey, come on. Numbers. So the width. Trying to type it in now. There we go. 12. Length. 12 blocks. And we'll just go... That's it. Wow, that is so cool. So we'll go into the house here and we can count the size of the floor right here and set a diamond floor in. So awesome, guys. Let's just get out of here. Quit the title. So I know I've already said it 100 times during this video, but I am 
very, very impressed with this. This is definitely going to go in my kids' room. If you're just starting out with a Raspberry Pi, go ahead and mess around with this because it's not just for children. This is a really good learning tool for all ages. I'm very impressed with these people. I've actually been in contact with them and I'm trying to get a kit. It's a little pricey for what it is, but if you just want to start out, it's a good start. I mean, if you want to put the money down, I think it's 250 bucks. Comes with a monitor, everything you need to run your Raspberry Pi, keyboard, everything. I really appreciate you guys watching. If you could, hit that like button and subscribe, and I will leave a link to their website down below, so go check them out.